Jack of Spades. Just take the one off the top, Darren. No, Darren. Nixie. Um, seven and Oh, they'd be like pointy ones again. Spades, Nixie, spades. Okay. Ace of hearts. Queen of pops. Darren! What? It's your turn again. Oh, sorry, Radis. Hang on a tick. Snap. Two of hearts. You can't go snap with the two of hearts. It's got to be another queen. Oh, how many times do we have to tell you? That's the ferals for you. Hassle, hassle, hassle. The bat could go crazy living over their garden shed. So I live here in this rooftop where it's mostly not too noisy. Oh. Well, I did say mostly. I guess it's time for my little rehearsal. For the talent quest on Saturday night. <laughs> oh, I should be so lucky, 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 lucky. Oh, I should be. Cola, quit that awful racket. I bet Kylie Minogue never had to put up with neighbours like you. They're not that bad, really. <laughs> well, then again. boss of my record company. Hey, Nikki, how about that band I sent you? What? But... Yeah. But... But, Nick, I... Hello? Hello? Didn't like him, huh? I wouldn't exactly say didn't like him. He hated them. How can I be a talent scout if I can't find any talent? I can see how that could be a problem. A talent quest? This is a hint, right? You're going to enter. You're kidding. I hate talent quests. Because you want me to discover you and be your manager and make a million bucks. <laughs> Joe, you're the last guy on earth I want to be my manager, OK? Forget it. Playing hard to get, huh? We'll see. What's Leonard up to? Oh, what's Leonard always up to? Making another scientific breakthrough. All right, what does this thing do? Oh, watch it. Don't touch the digital volume enhancer. Oh, what? <laughs> what? It's highly experimental. It could be dangerous. Wow. Dangerous? What, what will it do? Will, will it blow up the neighbours? Look out, Joe, it's gonna blow! <laughs> okay, okay, have your fun. Oh, come on, I'm only joking. We don't have any neighbours, remember? Yes, we do. I just sort of moving in next door. The old empty house, you're kidding. I'm not. And wait for it, it's a woman with a baby. I know I was supposed to be there this morning, but, uh, oh, just, just, yeah, put it in there, thanks. But it wasn't my fault. The removalist truck broke down. Push down, please. Don't start crying again. No, 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 no. What? No, not you, Forrest, my baby. Yes. Oh, no, that's your 14th nappy today. Oh, excuse me, headmaster. What? Yes. No, nappies. Yes. Nappy. Dry nappy. Just one moment. I know the school comes first. Yes. Just one moment, headmaster. Excuse me. There you go. There you go. Sorry. What was that? Oh! Ooh! Oh! 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 I'm just trying to be friendly, you know. And this giant rattle nearly takes my head off. I was just going to tell her about the talent quest. Talent quest? Who cares about a dumb talent quest? You say she's moving into my old home. Oh, my old home. <laughs> the joint where you got dumped, you mean? <laughs> yeah. I wonder how she's going to feel about us. The woman's a killer. A homicidal maniac. Oh, you probably scared of bat brains. I bet she thought you were going to suck her blood. Oh, yuck. I'm a vegetarian. She probably likes rabbits, though. 
Did she look like she liked Rabbit? How would I know? From what I heard, I think she's a school teacher. A, a school, school teacher? teacher? Mm -hmm. Well, a school teacher. That sounds heavy. Uh, what's a school teacher? Oh, don't worry about it, Darren. The thing is, how's she going to affect us? Why would she affect us? Darren, I'll do this slowly. Try to stay with me. She's moving into the house, right? Yeah. Now, our shed's part of her house, right? Yeah. Ergo, does it not strike you that she just may have the idea that our shed belongs to her as well? Oh, oh <laughs> that again. Oh, oh, oh. Oh. Look out for the rattle. I'm out of here. What is this, a zoo? What are you all doing in my shed? What do you mean your shed? This is our shed. Excuse me, this is my shed. But it's always been our shed. Yeah. Now look, I own this house. I bought it along with the yard and everything in it, like this shed. Now I'm sorry, you're just going to have to leave. Oh, but oh, we we go. That's not my concern. Oh. Not your concern? Oh, no wonder our school system's gone to the dogs. Oh. To think I'd hear that from a fellow educator. I beg your pardon? <laughs> Let me introduce myself to its <clears throat> Professor Rattus P. Rattus at your service. Like yourself, I am a humble pedagogue, chief mentor and teacher of these poor fools, my pupils. What are you calling a fool, rat? Any more of that and you'll be on detention. Oh. <laughs> Discipline's appalling these days. Are you trying to tell me that this is a school? <laughs> right, no more talking, class. Back to your seats, everyone. No! Don't believe it. What's going on? I said no more talking. That's your last warning, Nixie. Dear, and are you scratching in class again? What's wrong with that? <coughs> manners, dear, and manners. Right out, I must not scratch in class 1,000 times, boy. Oh, but... Now! Oh, he can't write, Rattus. What do you think I'm trying to teach him? And put your hand up if you want to speak to me. It's not fair. Right, Nixie, outside and stand in the corridor. Well, that's it. I'm leaving. <coughs> Aren't you being a little bit tough on them? <laughs> Canaan's too good for him. And you can talk. Me? Disrupting my class. <gasps> oh, if you insist on driving these poor dumb animals out into the cold, when all they want is to get an education, well, you should be ashamed. But I didn't think that animals went to school. <laughs> well, that's where you're right. <laughs> he's off him. He's allergic to cats, you scruffy-looking flea bag. That's it. You're all out of here tomorrow. Oh, but... I wasn't even trying to bat it! Brilliant, Madigliana. Just when I had her sucked right in. Hi. Practicing for the talent quest. You're kidding, Mixie. I've got a chance at a gig. Look at this. High profile rock and roll band seeks new guitarists, strictly confidential top players only. And there's a telephone number, see? I thought you were going to be a doctor. I am going to be a doctor. But doctors can have fun too, can't they? Mm -hmm. Didn't you have a dream of touring the world in a rock and roll band? Um. Uh. Uh-uh. I once dreamed of being chased by giant foxes. Oh. Mix, mix you, you okay? Radis told me to stand outside. Radis is oh. all talk. Don't you let him bluff you. Oh. Hey, come on, Mixie. Us girls can't let these guys push us round. your heart out. Yeah. Give me hope. Are you in the world? I'm supposed to get my baby to sleep with all that racket going on. Uh, I, I 
Actually, Joe's really good with babies. He, he'd really like to hold them for you. Prove it. A uh, uh, coffee? I'd love one. What a dumb idea! It's all your fault, Radish. We take you for a school teacher anyway. She was starting to, wasn't she, dearie? And then fat Medigliana tries to smother her baby. I'm not fat. Ah, don't blame me when she chucks us out in the street oh, tomorrow. Oh, my big chance to ditch you lot and to move back into a decent home. And of all the luck of kids allergic to cats. Bummer! <laughs> Darren, for the last time, we're not really in school, OK? So stop putting your hand up. <laughs> uh, what is it? Can you hear something? Horrible. Oh, cover your ears, guys. It's Keith. What? Oh, and Kylie. Miss Uncool Kangaroo. I love your jewellery, Cross. Oh, Keith is an artiste. And don't call me uncool. What would you ferals know anyway? Yeah, what's the matter with you guys? Don't you know good music when you hear it? Good music? Huh. <laughs> Oops. Little Red Hot Chili Peppers number, actually. <sighs> Sounded like a chainsawed cat. <laughs> You're just jealous, Rattus, because we're going to win the talent quest. Well, why is everyone so crazy about this talent quest? Haven't you heard? The winner gets a brand new beach house out of Paradise Point. We're in a beach house? Better be better than a shed. I could see myself on a surfboard, actually. Oh, goodbye, Slumpsville. Hello, Paradise. Oh. One, two. Wow. Didn't you have a dream of touring the world with a rock and roll band? <laughs> I don't believe this. You mean you can actually play? Huh? Can we play? Are you kidding? We're the fools, baby! Okay, let's do it. <laughs> One, two, three, four. Do you reckon we need to practice a bit? How long before this talent quest anyway? Relax, I can solve the problem right now. Oh yeah, Cat Guts? How? Simple. We need a star up front. I should be the singer! Oh, you! <laughs> Fat chance, furball! <laughs> Let go! Run and brain! Get your claws off, flea bag! <laughs> Isn't that Madonna over there? <laughs> <laughs> Nick, great news. It's Joe. I just heard about this talent quest and... Joe Daly? Nick? Hello? Hello? Hi, Carly. <laughs> Seen Robbie around? Can you believe it? All day I've been dialing this stupid number and every time it's engaged. What number? It's an audition. Every guitarist in town must be trying for it. I probably left it too late. <laughs> Keep on trying. Sometimes he leaves the phone off the hook. Who leaves the phone off the hook? Is, uh, how will I know? <laughs> Try again now on Joe's portable phone. Okay. Uh, hello? Hi, I probably left it too late. It's about the audition. I'm not? Oh, well, great. Where do I... You want me to audition into the phone? Really? Believe it, they want me to play into the phone. I feel ridiculous. Uh, okay, you've had your little joke. What? I got it? I got the job? Yeah? Oh, really? Well, if you don't mind me saying, this sounds really weird to me. No, 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 I'll be there. Huh. Oh. What did you say? What did you say?
said he had to keep his identity secret so his band wouldn't find oh, out. You mean some kind of big time rock star? That's what he said. He said he'd call me and tell me when our first gig was. <laughs> Maybe it's Michael Hutchins. Oh, Robbie, you can't afford to blow this. You need a manager. I'll only take oh. 60%. Joe, for the last time, forget it. <laughs> Two in front of Grand Prince, three lengths further back to Dollar Gary under wire. Come on, Cat Swacker. Come on, boy. Come on. You can do it. You can do it. Get that lid out. Come on. Come on. It's the last 20 bucks. I knew it was you. Oh, go on, you nearly jumped out of your skin. Rubbish. I was just pretending. What's that? It's my new invention. An experimental electronic sound synthesizer able to analyse and duplicate any sound known to man. Any sound known to man? Correctly programmed, it can even improve the quality of a sound. Amazing. Kookaburras, trains, sirens, explosions, bands, anything. <laughs> Producing each sound so perfectly, no one can tell it isn't the real thing. Bands? You could uh, improve the sound of a band. You mean, with different instruments and stuff? Sure it could. <sighs> How's doing a mixie? <sighs> Sometimes I worry about them, Leonard. How do you mean? Oh, you know, street animals. Never had a real chance in life. <laughs> I'm sorry. I shouldn't trouble you with all this. Gee, I did not upset you this way. If I could only find some way to make them believe in themselves. If they could just believe they could do something like play a musical instrument. Whatever. It might renew their faith, you know. I wonder if this could help them. Really? What an interesting idea. Hey. Just uh, pick up the instruments and play. Yep, and they'll sound terrific. Don't worry, this will build their self-confidence. Leonard, you're a genius. What's that? Can it help us spin the talent? Oh, oh uh, sorry, there's a, uh, a hand must have slipped. Oh, it's a surprise, Darren. Uh, you see... mustn't keep you from your work, Leonard. Uh, uh, now, leave the settings exactly uh, as I programmed them. Uh, don't absolutely. forget, this is experimental uh, electronics. Uh, Above all, don't touch the digital volume enhancer. Relax, Lenny. Don't worry about a thing. Now. <laughs> <laughs> Hurry up, Barry, to the microphone. Uh, um, uh, um, our next act, folks, is a, uh, a mystery act. <laughs> Appearing unofficially for the first time. Oh, I haven't time for this. I'm in the music business. So, uh, please put your hands and paws and things together for the thing of these. Yay! That's <laughs> funny. <laughs> You're the mystery act? I don't believe it myself. I'm supposed to meet a band here tonight. I knew I shouldn't have agreed to this. Calm down, folks. Won't be long now. We hope. Or they'll start chucking stuff at us. <laughs> Kylie? You set me up with Keith? I'll get you for this. <laughs> Someone who can find. Huh. Yes, it is the night. Listen, can we get started? They're getting a bit noisy out there. Hey, one, two, go! Oh, uh, a slimy kangaroo down spot. Slimy kangaroo down. Slimy kangaroo down spot. Slimy kangaroo down. Um, all together now. Slimy Uh, good thinking, Keith. Uh, I can see why you chose the outfit. <laughs> Settle down. You're acting like a bunch of animals. This is your last warning. Oh, oh wait, folks. Uh, uh, we've got another local act for you now. Um, put your paws together for... Uh, Come 
Come on, Servo. Are you sure you know what you're doing? Step aside, back. <gasps> this is a moment in history. <laughs> a one, a two, a one, two, three, four. through this. Cats went out in the 60s. Nowadays we're into rats. Rats? Oh. Ask around on the street. Oh, oh guys. Is everything all right? Can we get on with it? Hey, was there a be cooler? Let me talk to my band, man. Get your claws off it. Click or I'll belt you one. Hey, he's never done right over there. <laughs> Works every time. <laughs> Isn't that one of Leonard's inventions? You didn't touch the digital volume enhancer. Oh, what the heck is a digital volume enhancer? Oh, keep calm, everybody. Keep calm. You've got to be kidding. Panic. <laughs> so, the evening went off with a bang. Oh, very funny. <laughs> Oh, Joe's just feeling happy, because he can't wait to tell old Nicky about the fells. Give me a break, Barry, I'm in pain. <laughs> and Robbie's feeling down, because she didn't make it into the big time with Key. Cool, the jokes about my ears ache. But the real tragedy is that the star of the show didn't get to sing. The thing is, it wasn't really your fault. No, I see that now. Digital volume enhancer was faulty. Just not tough enough for rock and roll. Yeah, it was my mistake. Bit of luck, really. Could have been me who got blown up. Oh. Gee, that's wonderful news. Anything to be of help? Oh, honey! Oh, well, back to the old drawing board. Yeah. I still say it's all your fault. My fault? Listen, Miss Mangy. Oh, if you hadn't decided to use a sewing machine the oh, first If you hadn't touched the digital volume enhancer. Where do you think you're going? Aren't you kicking us out? Not necessarily. Oh. You're not? I have never met such a bunch of losers. And that talent quest. Mm. Well, I've had a change of heart. You were right, Rattus. My conscience will not let me give up on you. Oh, does this mean we can stay? For the time being, anyway. Yeah. Oh. Oh. What's that? Homework. Homework? What's homework? Oh. Math, science, Latin. You know, the usual. Now, they're tomorrow's assignments, and they're to be handed in first thing in the morning. And if any one of you is late, you will all be on detention. Oh? All next week. Oh. You've got to be kidding. Kidding, Professor. But I thought this is what you wanted. A captive audience? Now, I'm just going to lock the door, and I'll let the class thank you in its own words. Oh, uh, hang on a minute, Toots. Uh, uh, can we negotiate? Uh, right, bitches. What have you done? Me? <laughs> Don't blame me, flea bag. <laughs> Nearly gets us. Electrocuted. Settle down, Nixie. You're alive, aren't you? Locked up. I can't stand being locked up. Denza, uh, get a grip on yourself, mate. <laughs>
Bye-bye.